Testo Fuel Supplement Review. Hey, what's up guys, it's Josh here. Today I wanna to do a little review on a supplement called Testo Fuel, and it is a all natural testosterone booster. I will try to put like uh, the supplement facts, so if you just wanna see exactly what's in this supplement, you can see right away. I know that's how I am. I don't really wanna you know, care about anything else, any of the marketing. I wanna know exactly what's in it, and I will kind of do my judgment from there. So, and when it comes to testosterone boosting supplements, I kind of think you have three categories. One is like part hardcore like actual steroids the strongest of the strong anabolics then you have kind of something in the middle something like i would say is like a sarm which is kind of like a steroid but it's much much safer and maybe something like anti-estrogen both of those were, will be considered drugs and very few of them are like legal you would need a prescription although they do work and then the third category you have here which is all natural things that actually do boost and help your testosterone things that you could find in food and things that you could take almost all the time because they are all natural and that's what you have here. To be honest, I think most guys, once they're 25 plus, should be having some sort of superfood that will boost their testosterone whether they're eating really, really healthy or they're exercising or they're getting plenty of you know sunlight and all the stuff that helps testosterone. I just think that it's so easy to get stuck inside, to get stuck not working out, to get stuck cheating somehow, whether it's like bad food, this, that, and having something to just take regularly that's gonna help your testosterone levels, I think is just really good because I feel like we're almost under attack in today's society because it's just so many different angles that we could have our hormones affected that it's nice to just take something to balance it out. I think almost all guys should be aware of it. If they're not gonna take a natural testosterone supplement, they should at least be taking a superfood that does it as well. So anyways, guys, let me just run through the ingredients. They don't have too, too many. And then also, if you're kind of interested to see how these ingredients play a role in the supplement you can go on the website and they have probably like two paragraphs for each individual ingredient explaining why they put it in the mix and all this stuff has been like researched and proven so it's not just like some theory somebody said like there is actual evidence behind the reason that they put these ingredients in the supplement d3 is something you get from the sun it's just very very good i have seen that it boosts testosterone k2 i have not researched that one enough vitamin b6 but the b vitamins are just good to have almost any time um, usually b vitamins up the absorption so they will allow you to absorb other things better so that's probably why they put it in here you have magnesium and i absolutely love magnesium more people should take magnesium it naturally relaxes you and it's just fantastic they have it here a pretty decent size of 200 milligrams and it also is a good form of magnesium with magnesium aspartate there's a few cheaper kinds and they did not use it here then they also have zinc it does boost testosterone and it kind of works hand in hand with magnesium so so that's good that they put it in here. Deaspartic acid, now that's like the main big thing. I think that's like one of the biggest driving factors of this supplement, and it is one of the most researched testosterone boosting supplements out there. The only issue is that you have to take a lot of it. You have to take a few grams of it. No worries here, because you have 2.3 grams for the serving there. The only issue was that you have to take a lot of it and they dosed it correctly here. And it is probably one of the most researched natural testosterone boosters that you could take. So feel free to Google deaspartic acid. I've heard about it for years. And it's one of the main things that kind of got me excited about this. Korean ginseng extract to be honest guys i have not done too much research on that i've tried ginseng a bunch of times it usually is awakening and it almost kind of goes hand in hand with caffeine i'll have to see if there's like a testosterone boosting extra effect there now fenugreek fenugreek is something that um, it's not really a testosterone booster but i think it's supposed to like improve all aspects of like sexuality in men although it does not boost their testosterone. I actually really, really like fenugreek. I have a big ass bag of it at home, like 500 grams. Um, it doesn't taste that bad. And it also is like a natural bulk laxative too, kind of similar to fiber. So I really, really like fenugreek. And I think it's just kind of overall boost your sexual health, not necessarily boost your tea, but kind of works well in this mix. And then the last one we got here is oyster extract. Now I had no idea that oysters were, you know, gonna boost your sex drive or your testosterone or anything like that but it is a very, very common thing. I was actually watching like a James Bond movie 
and he's about to eat these oysters and then the girl's like ah oh, we're not gonna do anything later you know and he's like oh well if we're not gonna fool around later i'm not gonna eat the oysters no honeymoon this is business well i won't need these and i'm like really like oysters are a bat known that i have no idea but they have oyster in here and not only that but they have the extract so it's the more potent version so that's just a quick rundown of this stuff um not too complex but everything in here was dosed correctly so let's jump into the pros of the supplement the pros is that it uses clear capsules so one thing they could do is they could heat press this thing which is basically you know hard little tabs but that is going to destroy all the little delicate aspects to the supplements which so i don't like that and then on top of that you know usually testosterone boosters they like to make it seem like crazy like a, a black and yellow capsule red capsule blue capsule i really do not like any sort of artificial colors and i literally won't take supplements that have those colored caps so i'm really glad that they kept it like how they should and just used normal capsules that are see-through that's exactly what i wanted another pro is that it is an all-natural formula so this is very very safe and almost anybody could take it because this is essentially like things that you could get from food it's not like going to be a drug or a steroid or anything kind of weird but it also is ingredients that is supposed to work. Like I wouldn't necessarily recommend probably somebody under 25 take a testosterone booster just because you have so much already. And if you're, you know, below 16, 15, 14 where your testosterone isn't maxed out, you know, it's, it's on its way. So you don't really need to like worry about it, you know? But I think if you were to take this, every, anybody would be fine and maybe it would benefit you. I don't know, cause it's just like a food, it's basically just, a little bits of food that naturally help testosterone. And then the last pro is that it has proven ingredients. Feel free to go and search any of these ingredients up. They are very well known. They have been very well documented. And on their website, like I said, they have like a paragraph or two on each one of these compounds. And I almost was gonna read it, but then I'm gonna be like, I'm gonna be reading these things for like five minutes. So if you're curious to see what these actual ingredients do, feel free to check on the website. To be honest, guys, I don't have too many cons of this one. It is a little bit pricey. It is $50 for 30 servings, but it is four capsules per serving and it is, you know, dosed correctly and it is supposed to work. So it would be nice if there was a little bit of a bulk offer, like if you wanted to get a couple bottles and they would be a little bit cheaper, that would be kind of nice. But to be honest, it is a little bit pricey, but at the same time, it's something that works and it's, there's no flaws here. There's no real corner cuts. There's not something that would be like, oh, like, it really sucks that they did this because now it makes it not worth it. To me, everything seems to be working in here. So absolutely no risk to taking something like this, in my opinion. Anyways, guys, let me know what you think of Testo Fuel. Let me know what you think of testosterone boosting ingredients. Have you tried any in here? Usually people come on this video and they're like, oh, you know, it doesn't work. Or, oh, you need this crazy supplement that was banned 30 years ago. That's the one that worked. Well, we don't have that supplement. We have natural stuff. And I do think that this is much better than taking nothing i've really enjoyed using it and i have definitely felt the effects just a little bit more calm easier in the gym easier to kind of talk to people just kind of cool in my own head really enjoying this stuff guys let me know what you think of testo fuel let me know what your favorite testosterone boosting supplement is we're on the road to 50,000 subscribers and i couldn't do it without any of you guys help you guys are the best having a great day out of here hopefully having a great day at home see you all in the next video peace